Good morning. It is Monday. Good to be with you today. Hope you're doing well. Let's get started with our devotion this morning. Matthew chapter 4, and notice if you would in verse number 11. Then the devil leaveth him, and behold, angels came and ministered unto him. You know, isn't it, isn't it wonderful when someone leaves? Sometimes that's the case. In this case, it's a wonderful thing when the devil leaves. Uh, devil's not there to bother you anymore. Uh, devil's not there to tempt you anymore. Uh, when the devil leaves, boy, it's a wonderful thing. Well, without a doubt, the devil has left Jesus. You know, but the interesting thing, I wonder why. Is he done? Will he ever do it again? Well, if you know, if you know anything about the devil, you know he'll always do it again. But I'm more interested in why he left. And I believe that the reason why the devil left Jesus is because Jesus rejected him. Not once, not twice, but three different times. And so at this particular time, the devil just didn't see any way that, that he could accomplish what he wanted to, so he left. Jesus resisted the devil, and as a result of that, the devil had to leave. You know, today, may I encourage you and remind you that that's what you and I ought to do when it comes to the devil. Resist him. Say no to him. You know, we encourage the devil when we say yes, when we obey him, when we like what he tempts us with. And so I encourage you to be like the Lord. Resist. Resist the devil. And resist the devil with the word of God. You know, the Bible says this in the book of James, James chapter number four. And notice if you would with me in verse number uh, seven, submit yourselves therefore to God, resist the devil and he will flee from you. I encourage you today, learn to say no when it comes to the devil, that he might flee from you. We don't want him around. We don't like it when the devil's working. And so let us say no to the devil and let us say yes to God. God bless you today. Lord bless us. And Father, I pray that, Lord, you would give us the strength and the courage to say no to the devil and, Lord, to say yes to you. Father, your way is always the better way. Help us, I ask, in Jesus' name. Amen. God bless you, and may your Monday be a great one.